All right, uh, we are just inside the back door uh, looking to do a uh, potential full system swap on this unit. Uh, we've got an old uh, open face furnace uh, as the furnace. It's a little over C width. Uh, it's pretty tall, it's about 49 inches tall. Um, it's an 80 percenter, five inch flue tied into a six inch Y connection with a three inch from the water heater. Uh, that'll have to all get reduced down to a four inch. Um, this unit has got, um, does not have an external filter housing. The filter is built into the bottom um, of the furnace base. So we'll have to get this thing lifted up because there's a little bit of a lip here. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to put that 1210 or 1410 box right on the ground. We might need to prefab um, a little bit of a riser base, maybe like a four inch. Um, that way we're above this lip right here and then we can put the 1210 or 1410 box on that and we've still got plenty of height um, even with a, a base and the filter housing I still don't think we'll get back to this total height of the existing furnace um, but that'll be a B width so it'll slim up a little bit easier access on these gas lines to be able to swap those um, drains running down into the crawl space back to the, um, the outside unit I'll show you in a second as are the line sets those will all have to be uh, cleaned and flushed out coil be a B width this is all going to drop down uh, we'll have to rebuild the plenum there is a supply coming right off of the plenum here that'll have to get tied back into um, and the, the electrical uh, double 30 pull uh, Siemens panel uh, that is probably okay we can go up to a three ton on that so just follow the checklist um, and then we're good with combustible air We've got a slatted grill uh, filter, excuse me, the uh, thermostats right on the other side of the wall. Um, and I'll keep rolling the outdoor units just right back here. Uh, outdoor unit is unmarked. Um, you can see line sets coming out here and in the drain. Uh, I don't know. It's probably terminating. Yeah, it's terminating into this and that's just running off down into the street. Um, it's on some old blocking, looks like. We'll just need to bring out a new pad, redo the disconnect, um, get that new unit set up on there.